Hello healers, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today you have a pick a card reading which is all about will you ever be lucky in love and when, okay? So we're gonna try to get an information here of what's going on, when will this happen, who's gonna show up in your life and when, okay? So all kinds of information here. When will you ever be lucky in love? Because maybe you are fighting with this situation, whether you have someone or not, and you just wanted to manifest something and you want to know when is this luck coming, turning your way, okay? And you can see here we are, we still continue here with the St. Patrick's theme here because you know I'm in Ireland and uh, I love St. Patrick's Day too. And uh, we are really celebrating this here now. And uh, hopefully this will bring you some kind of energy of love and help you out to manifest what you want. And we're going to try to find out here when is this happening, okay? Even if you're watching this later on, okay, doesn't matter if it's not St. Patrick's week for you. It's still the luck, okay, of love, what is turning around for you, okay? This is a timeless reading. You can watch this whenever you are watching this and it's still going to be, okay, something here for you that can help you out, okay? Like always, my details, the cards that I use, a way for you to support this channel, everything will be in the description below, as well as the time frame. And this is going to be group number one here with, uh, I'm a leprechaun, okay, with the leprechaun cape pin. So I'm a leprechaun, group one. Group two, kiss me, I'm Irish, okay. Hopefully it's focusing, you can see a bit. And the group three, Irish for a day, okay. This one is for me and uh, irish for a day so group one two and three timestamp will be below so let me know guys if this helps you out in any way if it resonates if there's any connection here with what's going on in your life you know i'm always happy to hear from you so make sure to consider subscribing if you're not yet there are many other videos here for you i'm trying to go live um many days of the week here okay so i have uh, live pick a card videos live uh, tarot oracle readings okay for you and there's also week ahead readings that i add every week yes or no pick a card of the week if you have a question that you know the answer is yes or no okay i add that every week and there's many um back reviews there are many other pick a cards love career anything that you wanted to add as well so if there's anything that you want me to create a pick a card let me know leave me a comment okay many other videos that you are asking me okay i'm recording now and i'll make sure to edit and it's coming soon any of your requests so thanks very much for requesting make sure you add more of your requests i'll do my best to create a video for you soon okay so again guys this is going to be group number one two and three timestamp below thanks for watching Group number one, if you chose the I'm a leprechaun pin, we live here to help us out. Will you ever be lucky in love? We do have here, let go of control issues. We also have here control cards, okay? Control twice here. Mm. We also have cycles. And... Let me see here if you have space to see everything. We also have it's up to you. Pay attention to that, guys. It's up to you. We also have in the near future. We also have peaceful resolution. And we also have acceptance. Okay. Interesting cards here for you. Just making sure you can see all of them. Okay. Okay, guys. Group one here straight away. You can see here how the control issue is coming here twice. Okay. So there's some kind of control issues. You're trying to make sure everything happens your way and you're trying to control the situation. Okay. Be trying to maybe contact that person and not knowing, you know, trying to know every single thing, every little detail going your way, things not going exactly your way, then you're not happy. So this is, guys, an energy here and you can see here the control came here twice so this is a cycle this is a situation that needs to end okay you need to learn with this situation you need to learn why you want to control okay allow the situation to unfold naturally okay there's something to unfold here naturally so i feel like some of you guys are connected with your ex or connected with some kind of control energy okay that you're trying to make sure manifesting things exactly how you want things like 
like uh, perfectly perfectly illusions okay guys because not everything is going to be always exactly how we want or people don't really act the way we want okay so remember that there is a cycle here for you to close okay because you can see the cycles here and this is this means there's a pattern here going on that you need to learn okay just look back guys if you can analyze the situation and see what are the areas that they're repeating over and over and then you're not learning with the situation because when, you, when you're still leaving things over and over again or seeing the same situation happening again in your relationships okay choosing the same kind of people just remember there's something for you to learn so you can move on okay so there's cycles that need to close so you need to move on and learn with something and this also saying here it's up to you and i feel like this is up to you is how soon you're gonna be able to really manifest someone that is really gonna be there for you and it's gonna be worth okay and um I'm saying it's up to you because I feel like you needed to make sure you work on yourself first on this letting go of the control issues, closing this cycle, maybe the pattern, something that you may need to cut away from your life, okay, a situation, a person, maybe it's just an attitude, okay? So just pay attention to that, okay, guys? What do you need to cut away from your life that will allow you to move, to progress, okay? To learn with your mistakes, to learn with your past, let go of the control and close the cycle, okay? So you can bring luck back again into your life. And you say here, you can do this in very close, very soon. It's in the near future, okay? But will, I feel like it depends really of you. And there's peaceful resolutions as well. In case there is a connection with someone that you needed to resolve something first, you needed to speak again, you need to close the situation with the cycles here. I feel like this opportunity will come for you to sit down and close the situation if there is a case, okay? Some of you may be trying to bring this person back, okay? And some of you just wanted to close, but you still want, you need that closure. You need to sit down and talk, okay? And this opportunity will come. And it's going to be really, really close, okay, guys? It's in the near future. So I feel like there's some kind of cycles here that you need to close first in order to move on, okay, guys? So the luck, the things that are beautiful, peaceful resolutions, things that are waiting for you, okay? Blessings, a new person is waiting for you. But I feel like... You needed to close and learn with this cycle first okay and be able to move on we also have acceptance here and the acceptance you can see here you are ready to release control of situations or people and lovingly embrace the rhythm of life so connected here yeah, guys wow okay beautiful here letting go again okay so the word control i'm here three times you can see here control control and again here guys three times here control so maybe it's a big thing in your life okay that we will need to release here things don't always happen the way we want exactly how we want like i say people really doing exactly what we want but we learn with that okay there's a reason for that that we maybe will we'll see and understand only ahead but right now is for you to let go and uh, the situation will unfold naturally there will be peaceful resolution okay so i feel like the luck is turning around the it will depend on you okay it's up to you how soon this near future will come to you where things are turning around because there will be a need of letting go of this control first. So it's something for you to work on you first. Okay. So once you work on you, you're able to release the control. You're able to close the cycle, analyze the situation and see what you have done as well, because it's very easy to point the fingers, but what you can do differently and something that uh, can help you out in the near future and closing the cycle and finally opening the door. Okay, guys, I feel like um, your luck will turn around in love. The when here, it's it's really up to you, okay? Because I feel like you really need to close this door, allow things to unfold naturally, leave the peaceful resolution to come, accept that, uh, you know, situation, these people, you release, release, because someone who belongs to you will come back. Otherwise, the door will open for, for someone new, but then you're not holding on, you're not uh, building your walls and uh, not even seeing someone new that could be there, much better for you because you're still holding on to your past or to your control trying to bring back so the moment is to release okay guys someone who really belongs to you will come back for some of you we will be back with uh, someone that um, you have uh, a connection with but some of you it's just a matter of releasing altogether and then this peaceful time okay these new opportunities will come to you and a new cycle in your life will become okay guys i feel like there's a new cycle there's new doors to open for you and uh, it could be a new phase in the same relationship, but it still is ahead. There is a pause time here, okay? But it doesn't need to be too long. It just really depends on you. Okay, guys, release for now. Control of this 
situation or people and lovingly embrace the rhythm of life, which I feel like very connected with here, here, unfold naturally, okay? Things will unfold naturally, guys. Things are ready to unfold for you, okay? Just depends on you how soon you will allow this to happen because I feel like some of you are creating walls that are stopping these blessings, these new doors, these new opportunities to meet someone new or even bring back a new phase in this relationship to come. Okay, guys, it's really up to you. So this is what I have here for you, okay, group one. I hope this helps you out, okay? It's not always easy, but this is the energy of what I'm feeling here for you. And uh, I hope this helps you to understand that there are new doors opening for you, okay? Very soon, it depends on you. So release anything that you need to release and you can allow these beautiful new doors to open for you, okay, guys? This is what I had here for you. Let me know if it helps you out in any way. And if it does, okay, I'm really happy to hear from you. So I wish you a lovely, blessed and healing day. Thanks for watching. Group number one, if you chose the Kiss Me, I'm Irish pin. We leave it here. Will you be ever be lucky in love? We have here new love. Wow, straight away. New love, guys. Also worth waiting for. Wow, beautiful. We have the magician and also wow twin flame <laughs> twin flame connection guys group two beautiful card here for you also compromise remain positive and we also have within the next few months wow and also there's another card spontaneity okay i read for you in a bit Okay, guys, group two, no doubt there is a new love waiting for you, okay? And this is really something that is going to be beautiful because they say here it's a new love. So you can see here a new person, okay, has stirred your romantic feelings. If it has not yet, it will, okay, guys, in someone that's going to stir your romantic feelings, okay, it's going to be those feelings, okay, that uh, you can't control, you know the attraction is there. And this is worth waiting for. So I feel like for some of you have been waiting for a while or you're trying to even bring someone back into your life. Okay, maybe you're trying something with your ex. Guys, this is showing new love, okay? So I really feel like it's a completely new person for most of you. Maybe some of you can manifest a new phase in a relationship, but I feel like most of you is gonna be a new, completely different person, okay? Some of you, you know, okay, see what resonates, guys, okay, feel in your heart what's resonating for you. And um, some of you could be a new phase in a relationship that has ended and is coming completely new. But I feel like many of you is just a completely new person, okay? That's going to be worth the wait, okay, guys? So it's worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. So don't forget that, okay, guys? This is divine timing. There are things that we understand only when you look back. Why did we have to wait so long? Why did it happen only now? Why are you waiting? Okay, there are things that only you understand and you learn when you look back, okay? And it's going to be worth the wait. So don't worry about this. Like, the, trust on the divine timing and don't keep overthinking, okay? It's going to happen because you can see the magician is here. It's manifesting, okay? Manifestation time in your life. You can see here, the open door... Um, the open hands to receive, okay? The blessings, you're gonna be able to manifest this, okay? So what you really want, someone that maybe you already had in your mind what you really wanted in someone, okay? Have an idea, some kind of uh, plan and dreams that you have, okay? This is the one, guys, because it's gonna be worth the wait. It's a twin flame, okay? You can see here, beautiful twin flame connection, definitely worth waiting for. So even if you are waiting for a while, like I said, or even if you can, re you just realize that uh, you're really not getting back with that other person, it's going to be worth the wait for this other person, okay? And compromise, guys, because I feel like the compromise is when we have these ideals, okay? Like these illusions that someone is going to be so perfect for us and everything is going to be looking exactly how we want. And there's some kind of compromise here, okay? Maybe your twin flame doesn't look exactly like uh, the other relationships that you had so far. And maybe that is something that is what you need anyway, because the patterns that you have gone through so far didn't help you, didn't work. So you do need someone that's a bit different, okay? So I feel like it's going to be someone quite, kind of different from what you have uh, dated so far, okay? From your previous relationships, okay? Compromise on that, guys, because it's going to be worth the wait, okay? Remember that, worth the wait. is a twin flame connection. 
So in the meantime, remain positive because you can see this is only happening within the next few months, okay, guys? So it's not uh, happening right, right now, straight away. And I feel like this next few months, like I always say, you can bring someone or, or a situation sooner or later, okay? You can bring it or you can you can push it, depending on what you do, because what the, the higher powers they're telling you here is like, uh, trust the divine timing, make sure you're ready to compromise, and remain positive. So if you do your part of re remaining positive, okay, having your positive frame of mind, taking care of you, taking care of your body, mind, okay, your soul, really like um, connect uh, with uh, your intuition, connect with yourself, the things that really need to work in your life, okay, focus on you and the other things that you need to work, okay, on healing from your past relationships okay forgiveness anything that you need to work in the meantime so you're gonna be ready within the next few months guys few months like i always say could be just two months few months okay could be really soon could be two could be six but i feel like it depends on you and i feel like you really should remain positive and uh, taking care of you and uh, be ready because this is really happening and guys it's it's a twin flame okay connection so definitely worth waiting spontaneity okay you move beyond the constraints of the mind and freely and lovingly embrace new situations again guys i feel like because it's new situations like i said many of you will be a new person okay it's gonna be new love like completely new person let me say like new situations okay so it's gonna be something that um with a compromise maybe is like i said someone that you're not uh, expecting to date or situations okay that are moving towards this connection that are a little bit different than what they have lived so far so i feel like they will be so different and uh, maybe something that you really don't expect okay so remain positive i feel like like i said guys remain uh, within the next few months your luck is definitely turning around in love because this is a twin flame connection this is something that you're trying to manifest for a while and it's finally here so it's like uh, it's gonna be so worth the wait okay because like i said nobody's perfect guys and so compromise here but it's gonna be the twin flame connection so you will know i feel like you will know as well when you meet this person that um, is the one because you're gonna be ready as well okay so i feel like in the meantime guys with this remain positive like remain positive like i said taking care of you of your mind, of your body, of your soul, the things that you can do for you, okay? Meditation, taking time for yourself, writing your goals, having your creativity, things that you wanted to do, things that uh, bring you joy in the meantime, because a few months, it's really, really soon, okay, guys? And things could happen and turn around. And when you don't even realize you're meeting this person, okay? That's how I feel. I feel like it's going to be some element of surprise here, too. So remain positive in the meantime. I feel like surprise because the spontaneity, okay? The word here. So there's some kind of surprise coming around this situation as well. So I feel like this is really lovely and it's a beautiful connection. Definitely worth the wait, okay, guys? Twin flame connection. Beautiful, okay? Like I said, many of you I feel like it's a new love. Maybe some of you feel how you resonate in your heart, okay? And that is a new phase in the relationship. That I feel like many of you is a new love, okay, guys. So, like, always take what resonates, but let me know if this helps you out, uh, resonating anyway. Leave me a comment, you know, I'm always happy to hear from you. And as always, I wish you a lovely, blessed, and healing day. Thanks for watching. Group number three if you choose the Irish for a day pin, we live here. Will you be lucky in love? Will you ever be? We have here release your ex, okay. It's time. Okay, guys, time. And we have here heart to heart conversation. We also have a sync 1111. Beautiful. Love this. We also have marriage. You know what's going on here, guys. There is something better. Listen to your intuition. We also have a year from now and we have self-love okay i'll read the full message in a bit you can see here guys straight away you can see release your ex okay so no doubt 
some of you at least are still stuck with your ex okay there's a situation that you really try to bring it back they really wanted this connection again and it's saying release okay the time has come to clear your energy like i always say guys it doesn't mean that they will never come back it doesn't mean like the situation is really telling you this is it there's no way but in any case it's really telling you it's time to release okay someone who really belongs to you will come back to you remember that so if it's meant to be it's gonna be a turnaround okay but in the meantime some of you will do really need to have that conversation to like have a closure okay i feel like some of you need that that's why it's showing here heart to heart conversation it's saying here honestly discuss your feelings with each other okay because you needed to release them but i feel like you do need to have this conversation at least some of you okay you're trying to have this conversation you need that to have closure and uh, the higher powers okay the universe will conspire and will allow okay maybe you're not communicating at all and you have no idea how this is even possible this conversation but the higher powers are telling you here that they will allow there'll be some door there'll be someone that will help there will be a situation that you'll be able to have this conversation but i feel like this conversation is really for closure okay guys and uh to release okay release this energy Put down these walls that you have created only to protect these relationships. There is something better for you, okay? You can see here, guys. It's very, very clear. There is something better. And there is something better that I feel like it can really bring into marriage, okay? It can really be someone that is seriously, that wants to get married with you or wants to have a, that serious connection, okay? Even if it's not marriage, maybe not all of you want marriage, of course. But you want that commitment, that uh, security. And you can have that with this next person that is much better for you, okay? And this sync with 1111, I feel like the universe is really telling you here, like, it's time for you to make a wish, okay? Like, make a wish. They are, they are going to grant you a wish, okay? So pay attention to what you're going to ask now, guys, because there will be a chance for you to to bring a wish, okay? Come in, bring a wish to you, okay? Because it's saying here, listen to your intuition. So I feel like this listen to your intuition, there are for many things here. And it's for you to really concentrate and focus what you're going to wish here because they're going to grant you. And if you're wishing for this conversation, they are already going to grant you, okay? So wish for something that really you, you, you need here, okay? Because I feel like there's a need of healing of releasing forgiveness okay it's not easy guys it's not always simple but it's just an energy that you need to release now to allow this marriage this connection this real person that is going to come for you okay which is is someone that is much better but they say here it's a year from now okay guys and i tell you how i feel here i feel like for some of you a year from now is the whole time that you need for like releasing healing taking care of yourself and then meeting someone new but i feel like this year here is gonna be really fast as well but it's a year to take care of yourself and also the year i feel like by next year this time you can manifest this sooner or later guys i always say that about this time frame okay depends of how you do what they are asking you to do because they are telling you there is something better. So listen to your intuition. Maybe your intuition is already telling you there is something better you need to release. You just didn't have the courage or the other ways, okay? Because you really need this conversation. But I do feel as well that in this one year from now, you could be already getting serious with someone, okay, guys? If you release this sooner, you can really manifest here the relationship that you're trying for a while that uh, you really wanted like someone that you really want okay not with this ex it could be like it's a new phase on the, on the relationship for some of you but i feel like most of you are just releasing and meeting someone new okay and the, it's someone that is much better because there is something better they're already telling you there is something better which is not holding on to to this energy it's like release this energy okay there's a marriage there's a security there's a really stable relationship waiting for you this is how i feel here with this so make a wish guys now if it's like releasing if it's like having strength having love for yourself because you can see here the self-love and the self-love is saying here you realize that love of self is necessary to love others so sometimes when we really stop to think how much we're holding on to this past energy it's really showing that you have been putting this person first and you're really not having much self-love so just pay attention guys like always take what resonates okay if for some of you at least you need to put yourself first in this situation okay take care of yourself for this time 
in this year it could be like in one year you're gonna meet someone new or it could be that in one year you're already getting serious with someone depending of how soon you start working on yourself and releasing this energy okay guys like i said i do feel like you will have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation if you do need okay some of you i feel like you really need disclosure and you will have so definitely guys your luck will turn around and it depends of you as well of you listening to your intuition of you working on yourself of how soon you manifest okay if um, you really don't do anything about it but you at least work on yourself definitely a year from now i feel like you meet someone new your luck will really turn around you will look back you will understand why did it, this situation happen to you you will have grown and learned Otherwise, if you start working sooner and if you really want to release, if some of you, I feel, you don't even want to have this conversation, that's fine, guys. Make this wish now. Make a wish now for the your love life. Anything that you want to manifest right now, the, in, the higher powers are asking you. Make a wish. They're going to grant you a wish so you can manifest this sooner, okay? But definitely it's someone that is like a marriage, that is like a very serious, okay? Wants this security, wants this serious relationship, uh, with you and is someone much better okay guys someone that uh, you deserve they deserve you and it's a completely different and i feel like you look back and you will understand a year from now i think things could be really really different for you okay like always guys take what resonates i really know that saying is not easy but they can be happy ahead okay i feel like there's a beautiful thing for you it's like the beautiful turnaround here like Really, really big changes for you in a year from now when you look back. But uh, you do need to work on you in the meantime. Like I said, guys, take what resonates. There will be a chance for some of you to talk if you need to close. It's up to you, okay? But this beautiful marriage, secure relationship, this beautiful connection is waiting for you, okay? Don't miss out on that, okay, guys? This is what I have here for you, group three. I hope it helps you out in, in some way. And if it does, like always, let me know. Leave me a comment. And I wish you a lovely, blessed and healy day. Thanks for watching.